Hi everyone, my name is Stephanie Prado and I'm the head of Children's Services at the Simsbury Public Library. Today I'm going to show you how to register a family for the 2020 Summer Reading Program. I'm going to go ahead and share my screen with you. And the first thing you want to do is navigate to the Simsbury Public Library website. You can find the Summer Reading page under Popular Topics or under Program. Once you click over to the Summer Reading page, you'll scroll down and you'll see the link that says Sign Up and Log Your Books Here. This is how you'll get to Read Squared, which is the software we use to track and log summer reading books. You'll see here on the Read Squared page, this is uh, what will pop up. And if you've never had an account before, for example, if you didn't participate in summer reading last year, you would click Register Now. If you did participate in summer reading last year and you remember your username and password, you can actually use the same login this year. So last year, this was my username and I'll go ahead and type my password in. And you'll see it will pop up with the family that I enrolled last year. So if you had a family account last year with a, an adult and several children or two adults or two adults and children, um, you should see all of those family members pop up. And now all you have to do is re-enroll them in a program. Since the 2019 program is over, you'll see that you're no longer enrolled in a program. You'll go ahead and choose the 2020 program to get started this year. So I'm the adult, I am the head of this uh, online family. So you can see that the age for all adults would be 19 plus, and instead of children, I'm going to select adult summer reading since I'm the adult in this family. So I'll go ahead and click enroll. All right, so it will pop up with your information so you can change anything if your email address has changed, um, if you wanted to change your username, I'll go ahead and click save. And then it will allow you to do the same for the rest of your family members. So we're going to go drop down to family members. I'm going to select the next family member and we're going to enroll them in a program. So if you have a, another adult in your family, for example, if you and your partner or spouse are participating, um, it will show up as a child account, but you can go ahead and enroll that second person in the adult program as well. Um, if this person was a child, you would select obviously the appropriate program. If they're birth to grade six, it would be children's summer reading. And if they're grades seven through 12, it would be teen. We'll go ahead and click enroll. It will again ask you to update any information. And then you'll see the changes. Once you've done that, uh, you're ready to get started logging and participating in summer reading.